Yo, what is going on everyone in the XRP community? Hope you guys are having yourselves a fantastic day today as usual. Hope you guys are having a much, much better day than I am. Uh, so here's the thing. I'm just getting over a stomach bug. Like, yes, it is over. Uh, I am no longer hurling, which is something I just hate doing. Uh, so yeah, that was painful. So it's like, it's over. I'm feeling good, but it's kind of like, you know, I'm not back to a hundred percent. I still kind of feel like doo-doo and that's the reason for no stream this morning. And I kind of feel like if I did do a stream and I would have talked for like a straight hour, I feel like I probably would have just fell asleep during the stream because I mean, still right now I feel fatigued. Uh, but anyways, moral of the story, I feel like crap. That's the reason for no stream. I will 100% make my best effort to stream tomorrow. Now, the reason why I just hopped out of bed right now uh, and decided to come on the computer to make a video for you guys today is because, oh my god, uh, we just got something today that I thought we would never see in a million years. So, let's go ahead and get into it. I don't know exactly what to think of it quite yet. I think I'll probably give you guys my analysis just by... Or right after we, right after I show you guys this video clip, but um, I'm kind of shocked. I have to say, I am actually really, really shocked, and I am glad. And I gotta say, I am kind of glad that we sort of got the no answer answer, and there was a lot of hesitation, a lot of you know inconsistency throughout the sentence structure in terms of speech, if you know what I mean, kind of signaling that, hey, they're trying to really formulate a sentence here to not reveal too much information. That's what it sort of seems like. But anyways, enough of me babbling. Let's go ahead and get right into it. Cryptocurrency market overall. Uh, eh. <laughs> All I really got to say that you guys know how it is. We got freaking two-year bear markets, one month, thousand percent. It's just when we go parabolic, it happens out of literally nowhere. So honestly, Screw this. But, guys, before we get into today's piece of information, Jana One Trick, I've gone over a lot of her information before. Make sure, please, please give a follow. Lots of great research. You will not regret it. So, check this out. This is a 27 second, uh, essentially, video clip. Uh, so, what happened was uh, earlier today, there was another FedNow, like, live webinar kind of thing. Uh, and I do remember the, the first one that they did, we act I did actually live stream it. Uh, we did get a couple of nice clues, but they never mentioned Ripple or XRP, which is what we were looking for. And gosh dang it, I am pissed I did not live stream this one. You guys need to hear this statement. This is the Federal Reserve directly being asked as of like freaking an hour or two ago. This is breaking hot off the press. Will FedNow settle using XRP? Just the fact that it was brought up and talked about blows me away. Let's go ahead and let's give this a listen because oh my God. And again, Jenna One Trick, follow, subscribe, all that stuff. Again, huge thank you to her for this information. Listen to this. Thanks, Tani. Another question for you. Do you know if FedNow would use digital assets to settle payments with XRP? So, kind of back to the settlement question, um, FedNow transactions will settle to Federal Reserve master accounts in U.S. dollars. Um, so, at, at this time... Uh, there isn't a, a contemplation of using other types of currencies. I can't believe we actually heard that. I mean, they brought up specifically, not Ripple, not Bitcoin, XRP. And again, I know the answer doesn't sound the greatest, but guys, if the FedNow system, which is being deployed in four years, if it was really using XRP, do you think they would just respond to the question and go, oh, yeah, 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 we're using it. Yeah, totally. It's, it's going to be implemented. Of course not. So even though they kind of answer with, uh, no, it's not using XRP or digital assets, if they are planning on that, would they tell anyone? That's the thing. I don't think so. So even though the answer to that was kind of a no, like, oh, it's going to be settled in Federal Reserve master accounts in the U.S. dollars, so we're not contemplating selling other currencies. It's like, even though the answer was no, in a way, it kind of makes you think if they are, if they were using it, would they, would they give off the same answer? 
Because I would say, guys, if I was leading this FedNow project into, you know, revamping a completely new settlement system for the United States, I would definitely not reveal what specifically was being used to settle, especially if this is some brand new innovative technology no one's heard about. So the quest, just the fact that the question was brought up is, uh, is just insane. And again, I mean, let's just listen to it one more time, just one more time, because this is music to my ears. Thanks, Sonny. Another question for you. Do you know if FedNow would use digital assets to settle payments with XRP? I just, I, I can't believe we're hearing that. Now, listen to this answer again and tell me if you can kind of hear the hesitation and sort of, again, inconsistency in the speech after being fronted with this question. So, kind of back to the settlement question, um, FedNow transactions will settle to Federal Reserve Master Accounts in U.S. dollars. Um, so, at, at this time... Uh, there isn't a, a contemplation of using other types of currencies. Hmm. Interesting to say the least. All right, guys. Thank you so much for tuning the video today. Really, really do appreciate it. Uh, actually, no, one more thing. The, the one other thing that really makes me think that FedNow might actually really be using XRP is they did confirm that transactions are irreversible on FedNow. So, guys, wow. Uh, amazing stuff. Again, not the answer we would exactly want to hear, but I don't think they're actually being 100% truth. Because again, if they did actually plan on using digital assets, and again, guys, this platform is like four or five years out from being launched, I don't think they would let us know it, like that much in depth about what they're using right now. So... Thank you guys for tuning the video today. Make sure to smash the like, subscribe, check the links in the description if you don't want to support the channel. And guys, make sure you let me know in the comments below what you guys think about this. Uh, I'm like still shocked right now. I've, I've only discovered this information around 20 minutes ago. I'm still just, just shocked. I mean, to hear, to see this kind of question be brought up to this level of significance. I mean, damn. Again, not the answer we want to hear. You know, the answer we want to hear is, oh, yes, we're using XRP freaking to the moon. $1,000 per XRP. But, I mean, hey, if they did actually plan on using it, would they really even tell us if asked about it? That's the thing. Got to watch what they do, not what they say. All right, guys. Thanks so much for doing the video today. Again, let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Amazing, amazing information. Really do want to get some of your guys' insight on this. And I'll see you guys in the next one.